sometimes dreams do come true. We really think that Glowforge needs to lengthen the amount of time after the project is complete before the fan shuts off, or better yet, give the user some control over how long the fan runs after the job is complete. When we first tried the personal filter, we were very disappointed. Very disappointed. It shut off too soon, and there was no way that we knew of to manually overwrite. But there is. This is one dream that has come true. Hi, I'm Steve. And I'm Janet. We're with Fleming Original. And we're putting the Glowforge Aura to the test. Thank you to MoDub2367 for telling us about this hack. MoDub contacted customer service and was shown how to hack into the personal filter to have it run as long as you need. To put the filter in manual mode, simply long press until the button turns light blue. Long press again until the button turns dark blue. And then press once for high, once for medium, once for low, once more to turn it off. One more long press puts it back in pairing mode. And if you wait a few minutes, it should automatically rediscover your aura and reconnect. But it does take a few minutes. And the filter turning off too soon was a problem, especially when cutting acrylic. The acrylic really bothered me and hurt my lungs. I found I was really starting to avoid it. Since learning how to put the filter in manual mode, we're much less reluctant to use acrylic in our projects. We know that we can get most of the smell out before we even open the lid of the Aura. And the smell that's left seems to dissipate very quickly and without causing the discomfort that we had been experiencing. Let us know in the comments if this works for you. Now that we know we can put it in manual mode and use it for as long as we need, we really recommend the personal filter. And remember, the more you run the filter, the more often the filter cartridge will need replaced. But make sure you use it as much as you need for you and your family's health. If you're venting your Glowforge Aura outside with an inline fan, you can accomplish the same thing by running the fan after the job completes or after the project completes. Please let us know in the comments your results. Thank you again, Modub, for telling us about this hack. Look for her video in the description.